All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Los Angeles Team Mentoring, the Teamworks program. It's me again, William, the director of the program, here to explain and demonstrate another fun and exciting activity. Now, we're in the health and wellness phase. So just remember, we're in the health and wellness phase right now, and today's activity is a health and wellness activity. Today's activity is called Burn Challenge and Calories Count. Burn Challenge and Calories Count. Now remember, uh, we don't want to promote dieting um, or watching your weight or whatnot. What we're trying to promote is just healthy, healthy eating. So if the kids are eating right, getting a little exercise, they're going to get those endorphins and they're going to feel good about themselves and really be able to take on those challenges and those obstacles that come across life. Um, so here we go. We're going to go over first the burn challenge. The burn challenge. So I'm going to do a little reveal here so that you can see how the burn challenge works. Voila! Oh, a little technical difficulty here. But here's how the burn challenge works. You're going to split your team up into two groups. Two groups, as it says here. Your students are going to be in their two groups. They're going to take turns coming up. So I might come up. I'm in group A, and I'm going to pick half of a Taco Bell crunchy taco. Mmm. Half of a Taco Bell taco. Crunchy taco, that is. Team two will come up, and the next one will be flaming hot Cheetos. And we know the kids love the flaming hot Cheetos with a little lemon juice. Next team will come back. Team A will come back, and let's say they picked Oreo cookies, and so on and so forth. So there's ten cards. Ten cards are together. Each team will get five cards. Once everyone has picked their cards, very similar to that game you did early on, where you're you know, they're choosing the dream team. Very similar. Once they're done that, they're going to flip their cards over. And for example, I'm holding up the Oreo. The Oreo, can you guess how many calories are in an Oreo? You'll probably never eat an Oreo again. Uh, there are 55 calories in one Oreo. 55 calories in one Oreo. So after the kids have picked, they flip their card over. They see how many calories they are. And make a big deal about those calories, ladies and gentlemen. Then they're going to see how much you know, activity, physical activity, that they need to do in order to burn those calories. So, for example, to eat an Oreo cookie, you get those 55 calories, but to burn off that Oreo cookie you've just eaten, you have to walk for eight minutes. Eight minutes. So to burn off one 55-calorie Oreo cookie, you have to walk for eight minutes. Now, of course, we're not going to spend all that time walking around for eight minutes, but your students can divide it up together and so that there's a total of eight minutes, you know, utilized or burned or exhausted to actually burn off that cookie. So if there's eight of us on a team, we can all walk in place for a minute, and that would count for eight minutes of, you know, exercise of burning that activity. Now, here's a little, little twist to it. If they do the challenge and they're able to accomplish and burn off those, those 55 calories as a group, they earn a point or two points or three points. Every card has a different point value. Now, if they're not able to burn the challenge, you know, do the challenge, the opposing team can steal, and if they can do the challenge, they can earn those points. So pretty simple. Two teams, they take turns, they take the challenge. If someone can't complete the challenge, the other st team steals, and they earn points at the end of the day. So burn challenge, pretty simple. Any questions? Uh, probably not. Um, our next activity is the main activity, which is calories count. Calories count. And here it is. So in calories count, the kids are really going to learn, you know, if they ate unhealthy for a full year, how many pounds they can actually gain in a full year of eating unhealthy. Then they're going to play a second round. And in the second round, they're going to have some healthy options. And then they can see, you know, what kind of weight gain they might have or how little weight gain they'll have um, eating healthier. So pretty simple. Now the kids, you're going to put up these cards. There's a breakfast option, a lunch option, a dinner option, and a snack slash dessert option. You're going to put these around your room, maybe in four corners. And the kids will walk up with a little sheet that is a meal description sheet, a little meal description sheet, and it's all there for you, very easy. You know, we try to make it easy. Um, and they're going to walk up and they're going to go up to breakfast option, for example. And in my breakfast option, in my unhealthy round, I think I'm going to pick the Denny's Peach French Toast. So I'm going to put Peach Toast. Then I'm going to go to my next corner. I'm going to do a lunch option, and I'm going to do the Taco Bell. Then I'll go to dinner, and I'll do the Chili's Nachos. 
and so on and so forth. So once the kids have picked their choices, we're going to sit them back down. And mentors, it's important for you guys to be familiar with the answer key. So make sure that you pull out that answer key out of your session folder because once they've chosen all their foods, we're going to sit all down again. And now out loud or aloud, you're going to let them know how many calories and then they're going to fill in the calories. So for example, I picked peach toast from Denny's. The peach to toast from Denny's is 1,300 calories. 1,300 calories. So I will fill in 1,300 calories, and so on and so forth. And at the end of the day, when they're done with that, we have a whole little math equation here, which then is going to let them know how many pounds they've gained in one year. So just fill out the little sheet accordingly. We'll provide you with some calculators. There'll be some calculators. Or you know your cell phones have a calculator. At least I hope they do. Um, and then you'll go on and you know, fill it out, and you'll have the big voila. Um, and I tell you, it's pretty eye-opening, even myself as an adult. Um, I was pretty surprised to see how many calories I can, you know, pounds I can gain in one year. Second round is, again, healthy options now, and then they can go through and do healthy options and fill out the sheet accordingly. And that's it at the end of the day, folks. Um, burn challenge, calories count, a lot of fun. Um, not about losing weight and dieting, remember that, but really about making some good choices so you feel good about yourself. Don't forget your question of the day. Don't forget to sit down and talk about what they learned. Don't forget one big thing I learned. Um, and don't forget your team bucks. And again, as I always say, my favorite F word, make sure you're having a lot, a lot of F-U-N. It's Will signing out. Goodbye.